What's happening beautiful gamer and welcome to Small Saga. Small Saga is a turn-based combat RPG that takes place beneath the streets of London, where an angry mouse seeks revenge against the god who stole his tail. This is an epic RPG of miniature proportions. You guys can see we're pretty much a little rat. And well, what's our goal going to be like? How's our future going to be like? That's, those are things that we are going to have to figure out. You guys can see a continue button because I believe the game continues from the demo. I played the demo a while ago and this game looks absolutely fire. That said, let's just jump straight into the game and show you guys what this is all about. Let's do this. Spring. The on the river. What matter of vermin lurks beneath our feet? Come on, worm, keep up. I'm doing my best, Lance, but your legs are twice the size of mine. Ah, this won't do at all. Here's an idea. Why don't you take the lead off for a bit? You think I'm ready? I have no doubt. According to Dad's letter, we just follow the arrows. They point the way to the God's food horde. So just keep following the path. We should hit it in no time. Alright, I can do this. Stay on my tail, bro. And here we go, let's go! It starts just like in the demo, what a beautiful beginning! Mouse Warrior Pro Tip! Hold X to the run, C to open the menu, easy peasy! That's kinda cool, like, you gotta take a look at the menu, it's a really cool, good old style, like, kinda like system. We got some trinkets, we got some skills that we can actually use to level up our characters, and I think that that's incredible. Lance is already leveled up, that's why he is a little bit faster than our boy Berm. And then you have the equipment too. Oh boy, the fact that you can do all of this makes me so happy. I'm gonna be able to power through this. Of course, make sure that you're running too, because you never know what's up. I'm also gonna be looking into secrets. I do not believe. What a weird bridge. It is weird indeed. Looks like the on the river rat handiwork. It's screwed, but it should hold. On the river rats? Do you think there are any around right now? It is possible, we didn't bring our weapons just for show. Are you scared? Ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, uh. no way. Not scared of anything, just like the Blade Master, Leo. Ha! Well, then Blade Master, lead the way. But yeah, this game, hey, that's cute. This game is absolutely adorable, and I am not sure if the devs change anything that was on the, on the game itself, or on the demo. I do not think so, considering that you could have proceeded through the adventure, but hey. Hey Lance, check it out, someone smashed a peanut. Nice fine, maybe you should hold on it in case that you feel weak later. But do not get too full. There will be plenty more food where we're heading. I can almost smell it. Mouse water pro tip, it can, it, items can be equipped from the equip menu. Once a food item has been equipped, it can be used once per battle. So if you're gonna check this out, equipments, nothing here. Skills, nothing here. Trinkets maybe? So they were talking about food, like, oh, here it is, so you can actually hold on to them. So, okay, so you won't be able to just use whatever items, just the ones that you're holding. Now, I know that I played the demo, but honestly speaking, I was following the game and I just wanted to see what was going to be the deal with the game. So I pretty much rushed through the demo because I didn't want to, like, too much focus on, like, everything that was going to happen. And these are the only river rats. Let's go. Not another step, you two. Or else you will have to face the combined wrath of Bree and... <clears throat> Yo, art boy! We've got company, get with the program! Stilton! Not another step, you two, or else you have to... We've done that part already! Rest assured, sirs, we will make no trouble. 
My brother and I are just passing through. Ain't that easy. This is a troll road, you see. Don't you mean a toll road? A little bit of both, to be perfectly honest with you both. It is 10 seats each to pass. How about you eat one of these? We're not paying two flea beaten loses, little squats, Jesus, Verm, words. Now, now, Verm, let's show some deck room. Sirs, I'm afraid my brother and I have no seats in our persons. Perhaps you'll be so kind as to let us go through, anyways? No seats, huh? Do you smell that, Stilton? I think I do, Bree. It's the smell of a liar. Let's got this two and scorch a seat from their corpses. Oh boy, these two do not know what they go into. Just remember your training, Verm. Attack them until they fall down. Exactly. Yo, the whole conversation between Verm and Lance is so adorable. It's like, let's get going. Uh, we're gonna attack Stilton because he looks like he's the less tanky one. And then we have two powers with this guy. Mega shot, let's go. Now, the game is a little bit less interactive, meaning that I haven't seen a way to like block or something. So it's a classic just turn-based RPG and that's pretty much it. As you guys can see, every turn you generate one of the blue eh, diamonds and that's pretty much your stamina. You're gonna need to consume those in order to attack. That's why you see if I use Mega Shot after this attack, I won't be able to use Mega Shot for two turns or maybe more, depending on what's going on. Just get a nice swipe. Let's go. And then see that? I cannot use Mega Shot anymore because I do not have enough. So I will have to block in order for us to generate another charge. Quick shot it. Boom in the face. Oh boy. That guy is going all in. He's got beef against my boy. But they don't stand a chance. Let's go. You little runs. Chief Sava will have your heads for this. Yeah, Sava the Slayer will chop you into most meat. Should I finish them off when you guys got the chance? Some of the Slayer, maybe the tale is true. What tale? Word in the tunnel is that the water vault fell into the under river four seasons ago. He grew up fat. He grew fat on the water waste. So fat that the under river rats started worshipping him as a chieftain. Some say that he is as big as a horse and that he swings around got weapons like they're nothing. That cannot be true. No rodent can grow that big, huh? Who can say? I always thought that he was a myth, just like the ghost and moss walls. Right, just ghosts and moss walls. Let's go, let's find out. Then our adventure keep going. Now, um, I think it would be smart from us, if we can, to go into equipment. Can we consume items while we are here? It seems like you cannot. So you can only consume items when you are in the in battle. That's interesting. This is a kind of like cool drawing. If you guys take a look at it, like there was a thunder, a storm. They almost drowned. As he was in there, the sword fell in and he became Master Chunkers. With a big god sword, he started clapping everybody out and he did that for money. Kind of nice ending, huh? Like the ending is just cash. Is that even cash or is that. <laughs> that looks like an S sign of one of those things that we used to make when we were kids. Look, Worm, it's a shrine to your hero. Whoa, Blue Master Leo! What's a sad to do down here? Perhaps on the river Scoutras build it. Even they know to respect the powers of the crown. No way, they must have looted it. <laughs> I guess that's more likely. In any case, we should say a quick prayer for protection. To save the game, say a prayer to the statue. Smart, smart, <laughs> that makes sense. I'm a, and, I, and I'm a smart guy, so we're gonna be saving. It's a cop statue in the field, most willed and a little like rapier. The prayer reads, in honor of Blade Master Leo, Slayer of Iron Fang, the Wolves, Savior of Soul Hill Village, and Hero to All. So now there won't be any confusions, and I don't know if there is any things. Now, this gameplay, I might be a little bit confused for a while because they do not support controller so I'm gonna have to play with my mouse and keyboard for a while haven't done that in a while oh you guys see that you guys see that 
Chunker sees on the back. Oi, Chief! They're here! Two mice? Rats, I could understand. But you're telling me that, that you got her asses kicked by two chicken little mice? You kidding me? Do not underestimate them, Chief. They know what's up. The bigger one's a scary good shot with a bow. And the little one got some fancy sort of work going on. Pathetic. The both of you. I'll deal with these runs myself. Oh, you did it now. Chief Saba, I presume it's a pleasure to meet you in person. What a letdown. You said he was as big as a horse, Lance. Well, he's pretty chunky. Vermin, mind your manners. Ha! What a smart tongue you got in there, little one. I bet it won't be so smart when I cut it off from your mouth. So it's true that you do not possess that you do possess a gold weapon. I say hello to Titan Reaper. This beauty can cut through all creatures, great and small. You guys would think that at this point that like that knife would be rusty or something, but no, it's not. Mice and rats, fish and filly days. I even brought down a, a night wind one time. Lance. What do we do? Keep your nerve firm. The Voltox B can carry an impressive weapon. But I wonder, can he even swing something so widely? Can I heck? I'm gonna crave you out like butter! <laughs> Bring it on! What an incredible like the music and the whole sprite, the whole battle like art is just so good. Like, this is just so good, like... You guys can let me know in the comment section down below, but there's no way you guys cannot tell me that this game doesn't look absolutely fire. Like, this game looks incredible, and it's like, once again, it's an, it's an old-style RPG, so I love it. Come at me, you flea beaten yellow belly losers! Don't take the bait, Berm. Now, look at that smile! That's the smile of a, of a nasty rat, and you know what? For the sake of it! For the meme! Let's do this, boys! Show me what you got! Wait, why isn't he... I thought... Fools! You drop your ward! Woohoo! <laughs> gotcha! Now let's go again! I thought it was gonna be something cool, like holding me on something like that. Oh, that's a lot of damage! Uh, okay, give me a nice swipe. Then with you, oh, I don't have items. Shit. Hold it up. Defend yourself. Go on, hit me and see what happens, boys. Uh, I want to see if I can heal him. Yeah, let's go. And then defend with yourself. Ha! You're not fun. Guess what? Fun's my middle name. I guess actually it's Ken Ethan, but who cares? Boom. Let's go. I told you it was a nice shot. He didn't pay attention to it. Level, 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 level up! And look at that, those arrows like in the body and the scratches. What a nice detail. <coughs> Save us down! Let's get the fuck out of here. Bye, bitches. Get back here, you damn disloyal gutter rats! You've lost a lot of blood, chief. Make your peace with the world. Oh, I have long made my peace. Very well, then this is where we part ways. Come along, worm. Hey, you're going up to heaven, aren't you? Heaven? The gods food horde just above here. We are. Then, from one full vermin to another, don't bother. The place used to be a paradise, but now the yellow god roams the hall. All that awaits you is death. Farewell, Chief. May your soul pass to the next world unhindered. Lance, what is a yellow god? That's a new one to me, but don't let it bug you, Berm. 
In all my travels, I have never seen or heard any deadly yellow god. Dude, you just fought Chunky Master, and Chunky Master told you, be careful, and you're not giving up. You should give a single one. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It's a crazed mutterings of a dying rodent. Just ghosts and most wolves. Right. Just ghosts and most wolves. Let's keep moving. We're almost at the horde. That was a level up. That was really, really good. And then we have an item in here. You found the treasure map. You add it to your trinkets. To your trinkets. We're gonna have to figure that out. And what is this? Most water trip. Feeling stronger? You might just level up. Then you get stars. Scott. Yep. 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 That's our system. Our level up system. We can go to skills. And then look at that. We can start putting our powers. So our boy lands. We could go for extra health. Or we could go for extra damage. Lance guys five star seeds when he wins a battle. Mmm. I don't know what are star seeds. But it sounds like. It sounds like this is going to be needed in the future. So let's go for it. Attack would have been the way to go, but you never know. And then for my boy, just more strength, because that's the only thing that he can go for. Let's go. Can we do another one? No. <laughs> and then we got trinkets. My treasure is yours for the taking, but you will have to find it first. And I cannot really do anything, so sure. Let's get going. To heaven. This is it. Brace yourself for glory. For all of those delicious and powerful things that we will find ahead. Let's go to heaven. Pistachio nut, sunflower seeds, it's a grocery store! And some hand spins. Heaven. What a beautiful de definition of heaven. Treat softly. These rats think that they're a big shot because they're in heaven, huh? Whoa! Beautiful, isn't it? Fruit, grains, meat. Items I cannot even describe. All neatly wrapped and ours for the taking. But we must undowl. But, but we must undowl. That letter says that the horde is overrun with hungry gods at dawn. Oh boy, oh boy, what do we start with? Corn? Let's find some corn! Banana! Bananas! And bread! And, 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 is that chocolate that is milk? Dude, I didn't know rats can eat chocolate. Damn. Calm down, Worm. It's seeds that we want. Seeds? How boring. Boring, yes, but they are valuable and imperishable. Lead the way. I think they are sorted at the end of this corridor. I didn't know that rats can actually not eat perishable stuff. I thought that they could eat anything. Vegetables, I wanna go potatoes! Do not get distracted, focus on the potatoes! I wanted the tomato soup. We can, can we get some of it? Tomato soup is good. Yo, 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 wait! What? I have seen those before. They are sinister contraptions. One wrong thing and BAM! The bar comes down and snaps your neck in two. I'll call them Thunder Snares. Are you serious? They look so harmless. Don't even touch them. Let's threat slightly. What happens if I do though? I cannot! Ah, oh, come on. I wanted to touch it. I wanted to see what happens. Lance? Who made the Thundersnare things? Gods? Indeed. And they were probably left out as a warning. A warning? For us? We are trespassing on holy ground after all. Are you scared? Eh, I'm pooping a little bit, just saying. Just a little. Me too. But we have each other's back. That's what family is for, right? Yep. We stick together. And we shovel swords together too. I think I can smell the seeds. Then lead the way. Pam -param 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 What's on there? It smells weird. No seeds, that's for sure. Come on, Worm. There's rice, too. Pistachio nuts, sunflower seeds. Here we go. This is what we want. There are enough seeds in one package to feed the village for a month. Help me drag it down. 
and then the back comes down with a gentle tug. It's huge! How are we planning to get it back past the thunder snares? We'll solve that problem when we get there. This guy is so like calm down, like he doesn't he, he's super chill. For now, just help me drag it towards down the river. I will pull. You go to the other side and push as hard as you can. Got it. It's time for us to make a nice walk. Let's get out of here. I want something else. Ah! Are you ready? Let's do this, boy. That's the spirit. All right. When I give the signal, give the package a big shove to the left. Okay, listen. I'm, I'm shoveling. I'm shoveling. I'm literally smashing the, the move button just because it makes sense. Do you smell something? It's just a little... It's just a little fart. Just keep focusing. This is heavy. Let's go. On my mark. Push. 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 It smells sweet. Not good sweet though. I'm I'm getting I'm getting a whiff too. It's it's sickly. Yeah, it's a nasty fart, I'm just saying. What do we do? We stick to the mission. Om ma mark. And that's why never pay attention to other rats. Push! 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 Oh my god, I'm tired of pushing, bro. Let me go! Lace, I'm getting dizzy. Oh dear, can you keep going? I think so, but the smell is really strong. I think it's coming from... Oh yeah. It is... Is that... Behind the back. Now! Pam 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 That thing is big. That is God, aka humans. Did did it see us? We need to get out of here now. What about the seats? Forget the seeds. Get the heck out of there. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. Mm, 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 mm. Excuse me? Ow. Ah! Verm, no! Lance, it hurts. Hold on. Don't move. All right, stay calm. It's use your tail. Thank the fates. We can get you out of this. Right. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm going to leave the bar and you're going to squeeze it out. And squeeze out. I know you can do it. When I give the signal, just push as hard as you can. Just push, push, push. On my mark. Do it. Do it. Are you pulling? Yes! Let's try again. All your might now! Uh, come on, boy! Do it again! You have to do it harder! Come on! Get me out of this shithole! This isn't working. Oh, fuck. And warner of time. It. I'll stall the god. You find a way to get yourself free. Lance, no! This guy jumps pretty high. Lance! To be fair, rats do jump pretty high. Do not go! I... I'm... I'm... I'm scared. No! No! The light at the end of the tunnel! The yellow god! What do we do? I haven't. I'll die a virgin. Over here, you monster! It's a god, bro. Damn it all! Mega shot. Eat some of this. Not even a scratch. Hey, you over here, look at me! 
Yeah, humans don't walk that slow. Maybe for rats they do. I said, look at me, come on! Yo, hear me out, you little shit. I'm talking to you. Hello there. I got his attention. And now what, you idiot? Are you gonna attack him again? Really? Oh. 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 Ouch. 600 damage. Jesus, I had 20. I've, I've got to escape. You guys know what's gonna happen, yes? Lance! Lance needs my help. Chop it! Oh, shit. There's only one way now. Do it. Again. One more time. Oh, shit. Oh, God. This is dark. He chopped the tail off. Yep. That's a goodbye, bro. That's a goodbye. Summer. It's been a couple of months ever since Lance died. Unfortunate. Level up, Verm learned Rage. And then here we go. I mean, first level after fighting a god like that, and then not only did that, but also we got the opportunity to learn how to fight. Oh my god, that guy, this guy is insane. Why just one level? I want more. <laughs> I, I do want this one while in Berserk. No, wait, maybe not. Maybe more power? We'll see. Any trinkets? No. And then equip. That's my new weapon. Look pretty thick. For slaying monsters of all sizes, plus 5 attack. Probably a pretty slow one though. Maybe. I mean, I don't know how it works in games like this. It's an RPG, so... Doesn't really matter if it is heavy or not. It's a weapon nonetheless. Do you wanna go this way? Oh, so now the adventure goes like... Just go wherever you want? Ooh, pets. Ooh, that's not good. Excuse me? How? Why? You should not have come here, mouse. I'm passing through to Carnbile. Let me be, and I will make no trouble. Oh, you found trouble, friend. I am the predator, and you are the prey. You run, and I chase. That is the way of nature. Bro, have you seen that I'm carrying weapons, bro? I have a massive ass Victorinox knife. Who said anything about running? Come here, boy! That's it! What's this? A mouse wielding a god weapon? Now I've seen it all! Very well! Show me your true strength! Amuse me! Okay, Rash, Rage! Gober 6, doubling your attacks for two turns! I'll go for it! That's such a nice sign! Wait, wasn't that the Berserk actual sign? You are no predator, you're nothing but an overfed fuzzball! Bold wars for a morning snack! Oh shit, that's a lot of damage. Swipe. That's a double four! Do it again, boy! That's a lot of damage. Impressive, but it takes more than that to hurt a tiger. What the... Excuse me? What? Hello? What's... What's happening? What is happening?
Whoa, yo, is that a mouse? A mouse knight fighting a tiger? It's not a tiger, it's a... It's a cat. It's a cat. Oh, you got your ass kicked, huh? This sword is heavy as anything. How did the mouse knight even swing it? Oh. Oh, Grant, you're not dead. Steady on your feet now. Are you hurt? Don't touch that. Don't you dare. I'll clap your cheeks. I'm fine. Whoa, he's the real deal. He's Mr. Tryhard. Pardon? I saw you going pot to claw against the tiger. Bow for bow. Blow for blow. It was the coolest thing that I have ever seen. It was amazing. I was kicking his ass. Well, until he sent you flying, that's it. I had to drag you here before he globbed you up. It was a close call. You dragged me here. Where is here exactly? Oh, right. Hold on. Pam, 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 pam. We're going to an underground dungeon. Oh, base. Crumbell. Their burrows are deep, their convictions deeper, and their asses even deeper. This is Crumbell. The Sanctuary of Knowledge. It is. Welcome, welcome. I'm Sioba, daughter of Lady Gilda. She is the head of the village. Oh, you should come meet her. Mommy doesn't normally like visitors, but you're something special. I mean, are you looking at the knife that I'm carrying? Yes, I am. Fine, fine. I have a question for her anyways. I cannot follow him, so I'm gonna have to wait. But we can definitely do this. Let's go, now we can walk. Can I go up? Can I explore the top first? To probably see what the mole has to say first. Oh, these are moles, not rats. Adorable. That old tiger, a tried piece of work. Can't be doing anything when he's on the prowl. Welcome, welcome. An outsider. Ooh, so now you have goodies for me, you know? It's it's normally in RPGs I don't like buying items at the beginning. But lately lately RPGs are becoming worse than giving you freebies. So if this is a merchant, I'll buy stuff. Welcome to Tulias. Take a gra take a gander at what's in stock. Sure. So what do you want? Weapons. I need a sword capable of killing titans and gods. I see. Double edged, solid steel, it is. Sure. But I'll settle down for iron. Bella, look around yourself. This shop sets beats and bumps for the humble people of Cranbell. Cooking weird, mining equipment, lins and such. This isn't a royal harmony, you you quit! Well, do you have anything I can use? I can do you a pair of high quality mobile banded boats. Good for killing or mining and only five seeds. That's a fair price now, isn't it? Now, what do you say? Ah, let me see if I say no, what's up? Not for me, thanks. Suit yourself, come back later then. Back for the boots? Ah, uh, you know what, I'll do it. Sounds good, I'll take them. Grand. You receive a pair of more boots. Try to stay out of mischief. This village has seen enough adventure. Kinda interesting, I mean, I was wondering, like, with the size of our sword, I was like, why would I... Oh, you cannot... Oh, it would be... It would have been an awesome detail. Oh, uh, okay. It would have been an awesome detail if the game would have been, like... Whenever you equip something, it changes the way that your character looks, but I guess that's not the case. Anything else? Yeah, uh, whatever. You know what? Doesn't. Oh, can I get? Can I grab? Can I get? Can I steal stuff? Pick access. You have no need for them. So the mushroom leather boots. A cauldron. Some work. Let's go. Let's see. Where else? Ooh, this is one of the gods. Oh well, one of the prayers. So sure. This statue of a mole dress in humble robes. The period reads, a rundown's life is short, a written story is eternal. Lord Master Toby, founder of Carmel Library. 
Now you have two places to visit, the library and somewhere else. The crowd's happy to take our seats for taxes. But where is their support when we need it? Yo, take it easy. And then what happened here is this, is this a place where I can rest and sleep whatever I want? You wanna, you wanna have a, a, a good night with me? You found a roll of bandages. If I'm not mistaken, an equipment, probably another item. Heals a lot and stops bleeding, that's pretty good. I cannot play, my mama says it's not safe out, sure. Not like I wanted to play with you, you dumb dumb. You dumb wit. You dumb you wit. Hello there. Any secrets behind this? Ooh, a lot of books. Why would I... I mean... The books, this case, are all trying to read one. They probably... No, 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 no. Listen, we are... We're checking here for... For secrets, okay? Wait, I read it! A young viper found herself stranded on the bank of the Great River. After slithering for a while, she encountered a raven. I would be most grateful, said the viper, if you could find me across the water. The raven squinted at the flag wind before him. You are not going to bite me, are you? I wouldn't dream of thrush. I think. The viper replied, her flick tongue to tongue flicked back and forth. Against his better, ju his better judgment, the raven agreed. He picked up the viper in his talons and spread the wings and flew skyward. Soon enough, the two landed on the other side of the river. Safe and hard. The viper bows thanks. Hold up! But the raven, why didn't you bite me? You had every opportunity. It's inviting on your nature. The viper smiled. In all things of nature, there is something of the most marvelous. I mean, sure. The recipe of jaws, servings, uh, ingredients, sure, cute. Um, the Pact of the Five. Following the massacre of the Eastern Mar, Emperor Marcus wrote the Pact of Five. This is a legal document granted religious citizenship, citizenship to five key species. Rats, moles, mice, shreds, and squirrels. Carnivores were explicitly excluded even now, long after the fall of the Shuridan Empire and the rise of the rats monarchy, the pact is held as sacrosanct, forming the basis of modern Rodential law. That's kind of cute, that, I mean, it's pretty cool to see. I'm gonna take a, a, a photo of this because you never know if you're gonna need it. Two more chats and then we can go. A book, the old way. To follow the path of the old way, thou must abide by three laws. Thou shalt not harm a god, thou shalt avoid the god's gaze, thou shalt not toy with a god's tools. Wait, but we have a god tool. Oh shit. Are we breaking are we breaking the old rules? Is that what's going on? I mean, I mean, I mean. Sure. Obey these laws and Rodin and God may live peacefully. Side by side, as they have done for dozens of years. Disobey these laws and the gods will punish us with fire and suffering. Eh. Another book, The Rights of Masters. Personal bodyguard to lords, lion and ladies, knights and queens, bay masters are required to the loyal, chivalrous, and of course, exceptional in combat. In contrast, a lord master serves their leech by offering wisdom gained from two whole seasons of study at a licensed university. Larger cities often employ a variety of other masters to serve as advisors. Pledge masters oversee the health of a colony. Seed masters manage the city's treasury. Build masters specialize in urban planning. Of course, all of this fine counsel is irrelevant if a leech refuses to listen, as is often the case. And what you got to say? Dear Ruth, I hope all's well on the knock. I wanted to pay a visit for the young king's coronation, but alas, Cranbell needs his librarian. Okay, you can get going. That was a long reading that we that, a long reading that we had in there. We keep going for the end, but there's one more place that I wanna visit. You! You look like a sturdy lad. You're a warrior, are you not? Yes, sir. I knew it. You have those warrior eyes. I was a fighter in my youth too. You do not have the warrior eyes though, so I'm afraid to say you're gonna suck. I do although I do see that sword to the right. A member of Morida's Trimble Guard and all. I'm sure you were. <laughs> yeah, buddy, sure. Ha! Don't give me the lip, lad. I might be past my prime, but I had more fights than you've had your dinners. I've got years of battle tested, wisdom to offer, don't tell. Go on then, what's the key? Weaknesses! Everyone has a weakness! If you use the right type of attack, you can explode it. The right type of attack? Ah, you really are young, let's see, how can I put this? There are four kinds. You've got slashing attacks. You've got bashing attacks. You got spear and pegs if you piercing attacks. And the fourth kind is magic. 
special attacks like fire or water or whatever. Yeah, magic. You are making this up as you go, aren't you? Oh, shut your bake. The system is famous. Everyone has a weakness. Find it and exploit it. What about cats? Ha! You're talking about tiger? <laughs> Wish I knew. Sucker. I've seen more warriors slash bash and stab the kitty about his forest too freaking back. That's why you use the god weapon. No, if someone wanted to take that monster down, they would have to use something truly special. So yeah, he was a little bit useless. The blade is dual, but the fruit sink pointless. Okay, I, I wanted something else. You see, Miss Molly's book of minimal leads. Bleeding. When cut the rod and bleeds, small cuts will heal on their own, but large cuts. Okay, understood. So bandages. Stunned. So some people can get stunned, and stun intends to cure itself over time once the venom has left the body. Berserk. Oh, so these are the tips on what is it that you need to do for each one of the things. That's kind of cool. Tipsiness. Drink alcohol becomes tipsy, and just drink an espresso. Sure. Anything else that I can explore here? You know, it would be awesome if you just let me steal stuff. But hey, the game doesn't want me to, so... What's up, buddy? Are we ready? Guns to the room. Ready to go in? Yes, let's go. Sioba, shouldn't you be studying? Who is this outsider? Oh, yes, introduction. That guy on the right, look, on the left of the guy, looks mighty with that hammer. That's Lord Master Morvi on the left. Blade Master Nemean, the Edge of Night on the right. And Mami. I mean, Lady Gilda of Cranbile in the middle. Mommy, this is... Ah, I didn't get your name. Verm. Right, Sid Verm. Sir, I'm not a knight. Really, huh? Anyway, Mommy, I saw this guy fighting Tiger. He was swinging around a gold weapon like nobody's business. That stupid cat had no idea what he was dealing with. I think this guy might actually be able to... Calm yourself, young lady. Sorry, Mommy. Most, you fought the Philly Day with a god weapon. What can I say? Rotten weapons are so brittle. Such arrogance. To fight a god's pet with a god's weapon. This is sacrilege. Sacrilege of the worst kind. In accordance with the laws of the old way, a punishment is in order, my lady. Bring it on and I'll fuck you both up. Want me to put him in his... in the stockade? Try it, Pinnacle, see what happens. It is guy! Fire, I love this guy. Verm? Verm, you are. Mm hmm Everyone, shut the hell up. This mouse a visitor. He is not bound by your local customs. We won't punish you, mouse, but we won't help you either. Do whatever it is that you came to do and then take your leave. Fine, I didn't plan on sticking around anyways. But before I go, I need some information. I am looking for the one known as the Yellow God. The Yellow God? I am afraid that we do not know any gods on a first name basis around here, except Cormac, of course, I suppose. Have you heard of this Yellow God, Lord Master Morvin? I'm afraid not, my lady. Perhaps this mouse should head to Murida. One million mice and rats live there, nobles, merchants, academics. I'm sure one of them can be of assistance. That was going to be my next destination, anyways. Very well. Take your leave, mouse. I'm out, bitch. Oh, Sir Verm, wait up! She's gonna join the party, yes? Might have a word. Mingling with blasphemy vagabonds is most unbecoming of a young lady. Stop calling me young ladies. You know I hate it. Young lady, you are nobility. Know your place and return to your studies. Studies? Mommy? The feeling is killing us one by one and you aren't doing anything. Stop it. Not another one? What would your father have said if he saw you mingling with the vagabond? Well, that's not here, is it? Sioba? Ba bitch! That grog headed child. She thinks herself a warrior, her father's daughter, alright? Hold your tongue, Blade Master. Hold your tongue. Yes, my lady. Sorry, my lady. Let me guess. Your mom told you of handing her a dog. This guy is so freaking cool. He is. He's a chad boy. Wait, are you crying? No, I'm not crying. <laughs> I'm not good with this kind of thing. 
Mommy is so dang stuck up. Ever since that day, she's been obsessed with following the old way to the letter. No got tools, no got interference. But why God, what good that's doing us? All those covering the burrow not help anyone that when the tigers in the pro. I get it. I get it. Most rodents would rather hide away than face real issues head on. But you seem like a smart kid. I'm sure you'll make it through this. Wait up. Before you go, I can show you something. It will only take a minute. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Give it to me. Let's have a mix of rodents. One minute. Yes, just something on the library. Oh, in the wow, kinky bastard. All right, let's head the way. Yeah, what a kinky, yo, you kinky, really kinky. But hey, if the library is a place for you to enjoy the the the, the, the delicious, then we'll go for it. No problem. Are you behaving yourself, Sioba? I am, Auntie Youngin. Of course. Hmm. Shouldn't you be studying? Ah, I should, but I was just going to show this visitor the illuminated manuscripts in the bag. Huh. Stay out of trouble, young lady. Your mother worries about you. I know. Illuminated manuscripts. Just follow me. Magic, 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 magic. I'm not interested in some old books. Never mind the books. I've got something better. But you cannot tell anyone about this, alright? Especially not mommy. Sure, whatever. Hey, I'm serious, promise me. All right, all right, I promise. Push, 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 push. A tunnel! I dug it myself, come on. Oh, yes, she knows what's good. Hello? A treasure trove, huh? Yep, got tools. I've been secretly collecting and studying for a whole season now. Game dude, game dude. You see this? It's a God's timekeeper. I cannot read the runes yet, but I'm getting there. This machine, a fancy God's toy, I think. I watch a young one play with it for hours. It turns on, but the screen is all bind, so I reckon it's missing a part. This is all fascinating, truly. But if you brought me down here just to show me your trinket collection... Wait, 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 you will really like this one. The battery. Do you know what this is? Wait, is that a, is that a lighter? I have seen them around. I know they are a common god too. Even better, a god weapon, like yours. I've got it working, even sprunch it up to the back to proper punch. But it's in need of a field test. I thought I could use it on Tiger, give him what for. Maybe save the village. But I don't think I can. Not because I'm scared, I mean, I am scared of course, but I get it. You do. You want to take that Philly day down. But you know attacking Tiger yourself would be suicide. The other moles in this village just seen on their tails and rant about the old way. So you want me to let my sword? Right, precisely much. Could you? Sorry to disappoint, I do not do sell soul work. Sell soul work? Couldn't pay you if I wanted to, the village is far or broke. I was hoping you would do it, you know, because you're a chivalrous knight, fuck that. Like I said, I am not a knight. I didn't come here to do charity work. So, do you really... So, go rally the Dreamer Guard or something. I'm out. Ah! Uh. I am not running away. Sir Verm, are you, are you okay? Yeah, he is gonna do it, of course. You are pitiful, you know that? Yeah, I know. I'll help you. Really? Yeah. We'll go kill Feliday. You can reap the glory or restore your village honor or whatever whatever you wanna do. That's fine. Just make sure to follow my orders. Yes sir, yes sir, to the letter. I'll go wait by the lift. Oh ho ho oh. Thank you so much, Sir Verm. Now we have a new party member. Well, at least if I goes wrong, she'll make a good distraction. This guy, it's a smart. Yeah, whatever. Um, this is a phone, a Nokia phone. Uh, do we have anything else? There you go. She doesn't have anything to help. Uh, I can increase her defense a little bit because I think she's gonna be a permanent warrior. And then I wish I could remove this. Oh, you can. And then what happens if I do that? Can I equip you this? Oh shit, he cannot. Okay, okay. So she, I guess since she's the mage, she's the one. Okay, sure. Cool. 
No, let's go for a nice battle right here. That would be awesome. It seems like this game is not gonna have that many saves per se, or not save, but like battles. Instead, it's just gonna be like, oh, you get adventure and then big battles here and there, and then you go from there. Let's go. Return to the surface. Of course we're going to. I need to fight a cat, a big cat, before I'm able to do anything else. Okay, now we're on the outside. Um, it seems like nothing that we can explore here. Okay, the, this this is sprite for the plants doesn't let you do anything. What's up with this? What? What is this thing? Creepy looking, ugly thing. What? It's Cormac, the village's watchful protector. Oh, not doing a very good job, is he? Nope, I guess he's not. Sure, <laughs> whatever. Let's go. So, second round against the cat? Is that what's going to happen? Or are we going to be able to explore a little bit more? The warrior mouse returns, and with the moon this time. Don't tell me the little kid is scared of being outnumbered. Scared? All I see before me are an entry and a main course. Go ahead, mouse and moon. Use your god weapons. They want to save you. Oh, you do not know what you said. Time to mess up your day. Hold your nerve, mole. Hold my nerve. I'm done holding my nerve. I'm going to unleash fire and fury. All right, let's do this the good old way. Rage. Berserk. Light him up, Shinova. Hold onto it. Unfortunately, he cannot really do anything, so worm fire. Tiger, suffer. It's a super. It does damage. It does big damage. Swipe him. Oh, uh, burn him up. That's a lot of damage right there. But Tiger, Tiger, you gotta stop. Bro, you gotta stop. Okay, listen, I'm gonna defend because I wanna use my super attacks. Ha! Oh, no, that's bleeding. Um, I wanna use the bandages that we found so she can be healed. And now, burn him up one again. Once again. We won! That was an easy battle. Did we level up though? Oh yeah, he's gone. Verum learned cleave. We did it! We actually did it! But we didn't land a killing blow. That thing's still alive? It doesn't matter. That kitten won't be bothering, us the vi bothering the village anytime soon. Come on. Let's give mommy the good news. Give mommy the good news. We're getting the fuck out. Bye. There were things that we didn't explore here. Oh, okay. So you were not able to explore much. So if we go to skills, did both level? Yes, they did. So you can increase my damage. I can increase my health. Or Alice can see enemy HP. Yes. <laughs> that's better than anything else. And then here he can just go straight. So that's kind of cool. That's good. Being able to do those is fantastic. Because that way we can use more powers along the way. And then let's get out. Go have a conversation and then probably she's gonna be like, Mommy, mommy! And then we're gonna have to, like, you know, tell her, you know what? We're going on an adventure without you. They said, let's go. You know, she's a permanent party member because, well, she has the power to see through enemies' statuses. That's fantastic. Let's see what is going on. The battles are pretty fun, by the way. I'm just saying. Why are you still here, Vagabond? I thought I made myself clear. Mommy, you will never guess what! Sarah Verm and I fought off Tiger. We actually did it. You, you just slayed the Felidae? Well, we didn't quite slay it, but we certainly sent, it, sent him running. The mangy monster will be licking his wounds for seasons. My word, Sioba. I knew you were no Dante Lady, but this... This is something else. Huh. Don't you have anything to say? Huh? Little bitch. I do. You disappoint me, Sioba. Oh, God damn it, mom. I disappoint you. Afraid us from Tiger's tyranny while you did jack shit. You're short sighted, full of a daughter. What will happen if the gods see us as a threat? Blades and poison, fire and water, they will rain hell on us. And it will be the end of Karmba. Mommy? Get out. Fine. 
Come on, Varum. I'll see you to the entrance. No, Sioba. Leave. Leave? You want to be a warrior so much? Like your father was? You want to thicker with god tools and fight titans? Well, fine. You got your wish. I'm exiling you from this place. Worst mom ever. <laughs> she deserves a war. Mommy! Go on. Leave. Don't come back. Well, shit happens, yes? Verm? Wasn't it? You've caused enough damage here, I think. Whatever. You know, I came here because I heard Karma was the gathering place of the smartest minds in Rodentia. But all I found are stubborn idiots. Do you want to follow the old way or do you want to survive? The old way is survival. The old way is death. Sioba gets that, why can you not? Get out! Bye, bitch. I was too harsh on Sinova, Lord Master. A harsh lesson is sometimes needed, my lady. But perhaps, if it would ease my lady's worries, I could send a butterfly. A butterfly? To the king, a formal request to overwatch the girl, should he enter Murida. Very well. Oh yeah, we are out. Let's go. But I guess with that done, this right here would be a beautiful place to wrap things up for the day. I mean, we fought a cat and we beat the cat. So now that we did that, we are unstoppable. But this is a pretty fun game. I mean, it's pretty interesting. It's I just want to see how strong this guy gets with these god weapons and everything that's going on. It's interesting. It's different. I mean, it's... It's a new adventure, and I'm having fun with it. Pretty classy. But I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, don't forget to let me know by leaving a beautiful like, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to catch up with more. On that note, I love y'all, and I'll see you guys in the next one.